are a lot of Muslims, including myself, that feel, you know, there was always a time when people asked, well, where is the line between when the talking finishes and the action begins? And I think the action has already begun. The most honest statement I've seen in the press is by Osama bin Laden. He says this is a war between Christianity and Islam. The times in which we live seem to indicate that all of history is heading toward one great confrontation between the forces of good and evil. Now is the time for war. Any volunteers? Before, I could have been a school teacher. I could have been anything. A normal Irish guy with a beard. But when you have a fully veiled Muslim woman beside you, you're a Muslim. I'm white, but I'm Muslim. <laughs> We've kind of become used to the fact that Aaron's going to go to dangerous places. There's people out there that want to destroy the gospel and everything he stands for. They will kill him and all of his friends if they get a chance. My name is Aaron Taylor. I come from America. And tonight I'm here to tell you about Jesus Christ. Find out why Jesus was a Muslim. Find out why Christianity is the biggest lie ever to be enforced upon mankind. There is no radical Islam. There is no moderate Islam. There's just Islam. If you deny jihad in Islam, it takes you outside the fold of Islam. Because the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, he was the prophet of jihad at a time of war. There's a real war going on, and I want to be a warrior for Christ. We believe at best your book is tainted, and at worst it's the biggest lie ever to be enforced upon the whole of mankind. We have the Holy Spirit of God on our side. They have no spirit of God. I think they're 100% deceived to the core. I, I don't see anything but a clash. You're the one that are aiming all the insults at us. We're the terrorists. We're the fundamental extremists. No, you are. You're occupying our land. You stay out of our land, and we'll stay out of yours. There's a deal for you.